What is up everybody? You guessed it. We're back out on the dolphin again today. And I got me some go juice right here. Got some Dr. Pepper, Almond Joy. We've been powering through these videos like crazy, trying to put as much content out there for you guys as possible and get a little wore out. But anyway, we're gonna get on some bass today. We got some Ned rigs tied on. Also, we're doing the footage review for the Ozark Trail spinning reel. I got some 20 pound braid on this with a 10 pound fluorocarbon leader. And I think we're gonna put Ned rigs on that one too. And maybe fish a Bitsy Bug jig on the Black Max. But guys, we're gonna get on some today. We're out here on a lake that we have on post. And I think it's about a 60 acre lake or whatever. But it doesn't have a lot of huge fish. But what, what it does have guys, we're gonna get on them today. So please stay tuned for that. and. I just want to thank you guys for all the love and support you guys have been giving me over the past few months. Like I said, the channel is only about two and a half months old, so fairly new. And I just want to thank you guys for all the support. And let's get going. Guys, being it is Memorial Day, you know, I just want to thank all of you that have served. I want to thank you guys personally for that. But, you know, this is a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day to get out here and just reminisce on you know those that have went before us you know fought for our country to give us the freedoms that we have today you know i think a lot of us lose sight of kind of where we've came from as a country and where we are today you know it's a night and day difference we have a lot to be thankful for and it's because of our freedoms that were fought for all these men and women that paid that ultimate sacrifice that you know still are out there sacrificing every single day you know to protect our freedoms that a lot of us take for granted you know memorial day was set aside as a day to you know think about those who have went before us you know i think it came about right after the civil war but you know even then we still had broke away from great britain and we had a lot of freedoms that other countries didn't uh, and then today it's even more so you know all you hear is bickering about politics and things that honestly don't matter as much as you know people think they do but you know we have a lot of freedoms that we take for granted don't be one of those people that take them for granted because we hear people talk about politics all the time It's the third water snake I've seen out here. But they bicker about politics all the time. And honestly, I don't think it's a bad thing. I kind of like having two different parties. Could you imagine living in a world where every single person thinks the same way as you? I think that would be kind of terrible. You know, at least we have other people to argue with. That's your motivation for today. Please. Thank somebody who's served in the military or is still serving. And just take time to reminisce on why our country is so great. And it's because of the freedoms and the sacrifices that all those men and women, you know, paid and died for. So guys, raise a glass of beer, something, wine, whatever, to somebody who has paid that sacrifice. And definitely remember them. And we're going to get back to catching some bass if we ever get started catching some bass. I think I ain't nothing but bluegill in here. It's already been fished out today. Because <laughs> I am liking this Ozark Trail spinning reel. It's super smooth. Honestly, it's, it's, it's just as smooth as the Xfinity that I fish with all the time from Walmart, the green one. It casts good. You know, the bale is really nice. It's smooth. I haven't caught a fish with it yet, so I can't, you know, tell you exactly how the drag and everything is. But for 15 bucks, because I don't think you can go wrong with this. Even if, even if you buy it just to, you know, beat around or whatever, to have like an extra rod just in your truck, pick yourself up this Ozark Trail reel to go on it. Right, I usually have good luck on pretty much all sides of this lake. I don't know what's going on today. I think
think the fish know we're out here doing product reviews and shooting these sun dolphin videos and they're like, yeah, we ain't coming out. We don't support all blue collar bass and TV. They're taking a break, I guess. Memorial Day, their own break. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Heck, if I was a bass, I'd be taking naps all the time. Do they sleep? I don't know. Hit me up in the comment box. I just picture them just laying there kind of just hibernating up against a rock or a tree or something. I don't I don't really know what I thought. There we go. We actually got one. Listen. You want to listen to the drag? He's just a little guy, but well, he ain't even big enough to pull the drag. Right. Make the drag. There we go. Make it sound like we got a big one. All right, stop messing with him. Look at that. First one, just crapped everywhere. We got one on this little three inch yumdinger on the Ozark Trail reel. Guys, that reel, pretty solid, guys. You know, honestly, I think I like it just as good as the Xfinity. This little guy, <laughs> I had to drag like all the way open and he was still barely pulling it. So the drag does work really good, guys. And it sounds amazing once we got it to work, but that's that's normally the size fish we catch in here, guys. Just little, little bitty ones. But hey, they're still fun. You guys, I'm liking this Ned Rig system. I think that might have been the one that was hanging out here earlier that kept messing with the bait but never took it. Oh, we got another one. Listen to that. <laughs> he's a little guy and he's jumping. Second one on the Ozark Trail. Spinning reel. Guys, this thing has been pretty awesome. Whew. Oh, you're hooked right in the top of the mound. Pretty awesome. The bass are starting to come out and, you know, eat. <laughs> the sun's been out all day, so they've been kind of hiding, but that's number two on the Ozark Trail spinning reel. You guys, a lot of times, you know, I buy this stuff just to do reviews and I really don't fish it that much, but I think this one's staying. So I'll just be honest with you. The reason that this is paired up with this American Hero rod is because the American Hero spinning reel that was on it just took a dump. You would like wrench down to pull in a fish and it was just grinding. So, you know, the American Hero spinning combo as a whole, you can get it for like 40 bucks. So the rod is amazing. I love the rod, but the reel was garbage. So this is actually really nice. It's paired up super good with this. And I believe I'm keeping it on the boat, guys. Guys, this is Dink City. But hey, it's working for us. There we go. This one might be pretty good. The drag's working really good, guys. No, it's just a little guy. He was just swimming. <laughs> he liked to swim a lot. I told you, this is Dink City out here. <laughs> just a little guy. He took that five inch Senko and cut, kind of took about two inches off of it. You know, that's a trick, you know, after that top part, you know, gets bit by a fish a couple times and ripped off the hook, you know, they, they kind of get wore out. So you have to kind of replace them every now and then. Go ahead and reuse it. There is nothing wrong with 
you know, trimming it down like that and reusing it, especially if you got small fish like this, they're, they're still gonna eat that. They don't care if it's five inches long. There we go. It's a little one. <laughs> we got the fourth one. Little bitty guy. All right, welcome back to Dink City, boys. Look at this. <laughs> Evidently, they like the green pumpkin little yum dinger. Oh yeah, guys, if you're watching this video, we passed 300 subscribers last night. And I just wanna thank you guys for all the love and support you guys have been giving me. And you know, we've had the channel for two and a half months. I think it's pretty good to have 300 kind of within that time frame so I just want to thank everybody who has subscribed and pitched in it's pretty awesome there we go <laughs> another one on the Ozark trail spinning real look at that thing but look at this guy Another little dink, boys. Hey, we'll take it. I think that's what, five now? Go get bigger, please. The, he, he bit that sucker right in half, though. <laughs> I have a little, uh, I think it's about a four inch yum dinger. But I think I'm gonna take a little bit off of it, maybe about an inch. God, this thing's tough. Rig that up, because I know they love green pumpkin out here. And to increase our chances of getting something, put that on there. All right, we got the little Ned rigged up. The Ned rig rigged. We got the old Ned rig rigged. And we're about to slay some bass. I think we already got one. Yeah, we do. He's just a little guy. Hey, it's still fun, though. There goes another one. We'll take it. I think that's what six, five or six. Problem is getting these little hooks out of their little mouths. <laughs> All right, there you go. There we go. Another one, same size. <laughs> they must have. They must have stocked this with a bunch of the same size. Cause that Ned rig is catching them though. Look at that. <laughs> I'm telling you, they're so small that you can om you almost can't feel them when they bite. This Ozark Trail though, it's performance. Because I like this reel. It's nice and easy. It's made uh, fishing very manageable today. Now I haven't been struggling with the reel at all. I haven't had any issues with it. And we've been out here for quite a few hours. It's doing great. So definitely 15 bucks well spent. I mean, heck, people go to Starbucks and spend 15 bucks on a drink. And you can't pick this up for 15 bucks? Go for it, guys. There we go. The smallest one yet. Well, he's a largey.
All right, guys, I'm walking back to the truck right now uh, to go pick up this boat. But guys, we didn't get nothing today but a bunch of dinks, all right? Dink City produced today. And I think we got six or seven small ones, but hey, I still had a blast out here. Anytime I'm getting outdoors, you know, I'm having a good time and you should do the same. If you've never fished before, please go give it a try. Find somebody that fishes, let them take you out, try it out, and you, you might like it. And guys, if not, you know, just get out in the great outdoors and spend a little time by yourself or with a friend, whatever, and you know, just have a good time, live life. That's the thing. Just getting out, living life to its fullest and enjoying life. All right, guys, keep it blue collar. I'll be back at you uh, with future sun dolphin videos and DIY hack videos. But please stay tuned for those next videos. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, become part of the channel, like button, and turn on that notification bell. And guys, we'll catch you later.